Welcome back to Ether This is week 198, day one, beginning of Astra Anima season as well as water and wind season. And we have a little over 10 minutes, so we're just gonna jump into the battle first. Uh, we'll quickly go over the teams. Um, Regan, Plumeria. Dimitri is a bonus unit this week, so we're gonna try him out on just one team, which is this team right here. Altina is the other bonus unit. Uh, we have the Erika's with Azura, Kid Ike. This is, I guess you could say, for these two is a Vantage team. Hmm. Hold on. Uh, yeah. This is definitely not the correct correct set for. Fjorn. There we go. There we go. Alright, so. Uh, yeah. Shira and Altina both work on Vantage. And of course, Fjorm Emblem. Always Fjorm Emblem. Whenever this water season, we can do Fjorm Emblem. All right, so let's begin. Right. So I know turn one, since I got a fence, I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, my fence covers everything, right? I can't remember. Uh, regardless, yeah, I think my fence covers everything, so... You should be here to take on both these guys or just Lina if we could. We get fence and then you will go here to take on these two. Altina should be able to also handle Lysitia because of the flag magic. It just becomes a deal with Larachelle. Um, yeah, so let's get rid of As you say. this over here. That way, later on, it doesn't bother me when I need to move. Units out of the way. I won't lose. So we can get rid of this and come back over here. That opens me the spot over here so I can move Elamin. Alright. Move you here. You go here. Oh, I'll do it. And let them come, I guess. Right, here comes Lysitia. We have the flag magic, so... Delina. One shot Nifo. Alright, and then we can get we can even get rid of you, which is much appreciated. I'm going to stop you. Uh, 
uh, we could hit and run. We have Kanto too, right? So we can go here, Kanto, and then the only problem will be Lara Shell, but we outspeed her. Let's go, dance, hit, come back. We outspeed you, 38, 53. I mean, no. You do have Fortress, I was gonna say, do I have Fortress on this, but I don't. Um, and I should be with Elamine's save range, so. I would. Yeah, that would mean leaving Saros for last. Which could be a problem with getting the ether. No. Yeah, I was gonna say, you don't have a Tempest skill, do you? Alright, take out Sigurd. You don't need to be healed. 53 to your not 53. I won't surrender. Hmm. Why didn't she get uh, affected by it? Now I'm confused. She that was definitely the closest one. Did she not have? She had her, her weapon. So I'm not exactly sure why I didn't get affected by it, but um, sure. Um, what is it? Naturally. All right. One of these ones is fake. One is real. I'm gonna say this is fake. With utter certainty, I will go. Oh, that's tough. You go here just in case. As you say, close your eyes. And since yes. you're already ended your turn, it really doesn't matter. All right, she's definitely following Altina. Well, Altina, Plumeria combo. That's it. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm not sure why Lara Shell didn't inflict Sheeta with the um, flash effect. But yeah, there we go. Um, just Vantage. Cav effectiveness, Sheeta. I mean, a lot of people pass out on her just because they're like, Vantage is not that good anymore, but no, Vantage is amazing now. No, people are not running hardy bearings and calves are everywhere. Having Vantage against calves is just extremely useful. Day two, um, battle will start, time, short usual stuff um so yeah let's go the age of vantage has returned all right so 
we need you here, you here, and everybody else can just do their own thing. You can be here, I guess. As long as he doesn't get his holy night arm, as long as he doesn't attack, he doesn't get give the uh, movement ability to people. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, so we'll tank from here. Yeah, tank from here. Um, I guess it's Seros moves one two and then gets stance she'll be able to reach and that's the only way she'll reach if she goes deliberately this way and then down this way which is why we're gonna bait her to come out this way by using uh plumeria and regan by breaking this yeah break this dancer break this uh, that leaves forces her to come down this way and then we just figure out what we're gonna do about the ether I guess Robin will be left for last she doesn't have boots right nope all right plan is the plan over here so we're just gonna bounce this Break this. I won't lose. Put that right there. That should force you to come down this way. Following Plumeria. As for this side, we can break this and then reposition back. Yes. Naturally. You go here and you go here. Comes Mikaya. And there goes Mikaya. Sigurd. Yeah. And by Sigurd. And that one was the one thing we did not see. Of course, there was one thing we had to not account for. Seros, I mean, not moving this way. Ah, uh, we had this. I hate when I lose because of some dumb shit. I won't surrender. We basically had this map beat. Ah, what to do? What to do? I don't want to give up this early in the week. We do have ladders, so I will go. Speak. I will go. I don't know. Close your There's eyes. literally no reason for me to take this. So yeah, we'll just, we'll let you have it. We did have the right idea of baiting out this way, I just didn't expect not to move beforehand. So. You have my trust. All right. I guess we didn't. We shouldn't have been worried. We should have just let Seros come at us, and we would have been able to take her. Regardless, all right. So the plan is to use Ike and get Fjorm in a position where she can just tank. So break this. Some kind of trap. Real trap? Fake trap? Probably real. So 
So since it's probably real, then I need Fjorm right here. Meaning it would be best to go this way. Because then I can just reposition you, dance you and put you here. Yep, I can if it's fake then if it's fake then whatever I just break this and then I move him and one up. That's it. If it's real then I just reposition uh Regan's up over here, then I go over here and dance. And then since the trap will already be gone, I move Ike and break this. Yeah. But I don't need to break this. So, how do I break that? Uh, that is a question. Because I need Fjorm here. Which means... Oh, well, never mind. I just literally said it. So, break this. I'll protect you. Break this. Yeah. Go over here. Ah. All right. Fake. We're up. Move Ike over here. Dance. This should be fun. Put you right here. Now, do I activate his dual skill? You have even. I mean, odd, even. No Wings of Mercy. You have odd, right? Yeah, so you should come at me on turn one. I'll get panic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll just do this just so we can deal with Dimitri. It's literally for the the only one we'll need it for anyway, so. It's time. Let's do it. And yeah, we're gonna get hit by well panic mostly. That infantry school really doesn't matter. That actually did way more damage than I expected. Way more damage than I expected, but I think it's because of the panic. So yeah, that kind of sucks that he got repositioned out of the way. So I would like to get rid of this, but I also don't want, did they lose a unit? One, two, three, four, five, six. Did they lose a unit? They lost a uh, Regan, not Regan, um, Tresir. So. This should be fun. Oh yeah, you have that 90% damage reduction or 45% damage reduction or 90 HP. Um, I guess getting rid of the panic would be useful. And it can be done safely as well. So let's get rid of that. Now you'll end up over here. Our reposition, you'll end up over here, which is not where we want you. We want you over here. Hmm. You won't reach this time. Let's see it's something a one thing. With utter certainty. Okay, so this is the real trap. This should be fun. Sounds weird. 
close your eyes. Yes? <laughs> Over here? So this is the real trap. Um I'll protect you. I would like to move you one space up. And technically, no, let's not. Let's just give you exactly where you are. Yes. I won't lose. We still need flame over to give us damage reduction. And on turn three, we'll lose that. So let's leave it like that. See where it ends up. He's gonna go after Flame, isn't he? Return to nothingness. Yeah, I need a Flame for damage reduction, but I also didn't want to go up because of Dimitri. We're up. Yeah, this time we do decent damage. Yeah. Alright. Need to keep eye on that clock because I don't want it to cut the video like way too early. Oh, never mind. I was not watching the clock and I actually messed up because I thought I had a little more time, but it turns out I didn't, which means I just completely wasted that day too. Still, I'm not gonna live without a battle. Uh, this is happens before. I like this thing. Alright, so Element has to be over here, Fjorm has to be over here. And I guess you guys can work like this. You're gonna get dance in turn one, but because you're gonna be able to reach nothing technically. You don't actually reach this spot. So I cannot break open this because then he'll come down and Sigurd will follow him to dance him. If Sigurd doesn't suicide first, of course. But never trust units to do something you need them to do. I guess you're gonna rally and you get danced. That's that's your trick. Yeah, I guess that's the trick. You get danced by him and you get danced by him. Still, Fjorm should be able to easily tank Nana and Corin. Especially because I'm going to put Elamin for... Um, Elamin stuff. Trying to see if I can get Sheeta some buffs. Leave it to me. Oh, I guess these are the buffs that she needs the most anyway. Oh, I'll do it. Oh, that's tough. Alright, break that. Move up here. You go here, we'll dance and then we nudge. Speak. I will go. And then you stay where you are. Over here? You move here, do not destroy this because in just in case. Alright. One down, two down, three down, next.
And finally. This is so much fun. It is actually a lot of fun to deal with uh, Naturally. cab lines like this. Leave it to me. Uh, okay, so Close if you go here, eyes. you can move one, two. So I just need Shida to be over here. So I can dance you. Would like to trap Nana, but can I trap Nana? Is there a way for me to trap Nana? Hmm. I'll need to get somebody here. I think I can. All right, let's see. If you go and break this, I can move Fionn up here. Then... Regan could go over here and reposition uh, Plumeria. And she'll be here and she can move one, two, three. And then I can go Dancer and move one, two, three and block. Alright, we'll do that. Ooh, so, take our leave. And go right here. Speak. Go like this. I won't lose. Reposition. Move here. Oh, I'll do it. Dance. Yeah. Stop right there. Consider it done. All right, and that's it. We don't have to care about it anymore. Now, unlike my Mirabilis. This one doesn't really stand a chance against my Altina. And we can just player face her instead of enemy facing her. Gotta wait said. one turn to get the ether. Why not? Hmm. Orders, please. You have my trust. Ether. I won't lose. Ether. Leave it to me. And Nana. And this is it. This is how you take care of cab lines in 2022. Use Pantagem with Shira. Which is basically what everybody should be doing. Like, I don't know why I don't see Shira's as much. Considering how many calves are there and how easily she dispatches uh, legendary Sigur. Like she just tosses him aside like yesterday's garbage. Alright, so either it stopped recording or it's still recording, I cannot tell. Um, I am going to end this, this recording right here. Day 4, um, since day 2 was kind of a mess and we played the, right there the next one, I just decided to make uh, those two one day. So here we are for day 4. Uh, we'll start with the battle. Hopefully, oh, by the way, I do have a plus 10 Fjorm now. I was able to get her relatively quickly once I started summoning. So, I'm glad for that. It does suck that I don't have a... I also don't have a dancer, so I don't really have a way to get over here on turn 1.
This really doesn't matter because Fjorn negates debuffs. We want to make sure we have it in a chokehold. So, isolation is not necessary. So, wherever we go, we want to make sure that we at least are blocking everybody else's passage. So, can I get her over here? Not if this is a real one, which I'm expecting it to be. I could try it, I guess. Explain. Yeah, I was expecting it to yes. be. Yes. I'll protect you. I love you. I guess. Yeah, we can get rid of this. You know, this is fake. If I go over here, then I can go and break this from this side. And then move away. But I still don't get to put Fionn over here. I guess had I thought about that in the first thing, then Fjorm would have easily been able to avoid that trap and break this. So unfortunately we do have to wait another turn. Consider it done. Odd, 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 oh! I forgot. I didn't think about it till literally as soon as the turn started. I was like, oh shit, odd, re odd tempest. Uh, I've literally forgot until just that Point. second. I was like, oh shit, all Tempest. It is decided. Don't just hate it when you... Let's find happiness. You have my trust. Ah, I was literally... Oh, all Tempest. Completely forgot about it. Yeah, and this set, I don't have my... I have less speed on this set. Ah, I can't believe I forgot that. Like, literally, I was like, as soon as the turn was about to start, I was like, oh, shit, all tempest. All right, well, hold on. This needs to be fixed. I can't be using Arena Set on this team. This one is fine. Just need to make sure that I don't mess up. You speed rest form is what you run on this set. So let me fix that because I know you don't have it right here. I guess you do have it over here. Everybody else is fine. And this is the correct set, so double check to make sure. Seal correct. All right, there we go. Arena said those give me the HP, but all right, you need to be here. Uh, you need to be here. Yes, you need to be here. You can reposition Fjorm, but who's going to reposition this Fjorm? Alright. This Fjorm gets repositioned by you, this one gets repositioned by you. And you can go all the way up to her. You cannot reach there. One, two, three. This is far she go. Reposition Fjorm over here. Reposition Fjorm over here. You move and swap over here, leaves the other one over here. Then you can move up here. But I also don't want you directly. So technically I don't need to move you. You can just move one space because I'm going for this spot right here. So one space is fine.
you can go behind her and all it needs is that you are yeah it really doesn't matter I guess where you end up as long as you're within two spaces And we're isolating you so you don't get your restore off. So you actually go for the head immediately. I'll protect you. Lady Niffle. All we need to do is survive one hit from you. Yes? And we have the speed for it. As you say. Alright. You gotta go here regardless. Okay, we can do it like this. And then you can move here. There's the dance. Echidna does not really have the player face. There's the restore trap gone. And here comes the big hit from Lysithia. I do not have time to waste. She still do like 20 damage. Yeah. yeah. And Tracia. It's just like what? Four damage or something like that? One damage. All right. Orders, please. Get rid of you. You won't get past me. Over here? Yes. I won't lose. It is decided. I love you. Consider it done. No rally, so just calm down and get killed. Cool. Now all that they got is the leaf left, and that's not really that big a challenge. That's it. And it's Altina's bonus pick, so we'll let her get this kill. Yeah. Alright, yeah, that one wasn't too difficult. I mean, Lysitia hits hard, but she doesn't have armor penetration. It's not like I'm getting hit by uh, uh, duo chrome with dead eye that's the only thing that guarantee kills Fionn day five their fans so 
All right, we'll see what happens to me today. Ophelia. All right, remember, I cannot set up on turn one because of Dimitri. I have to set up on turn two. So, but I can uh, go after things on this side, like set up on this side because Dimitri cannot reach on this side over here. So one, two, three. All right, so I need to wait to turn two to be able to set up Erica over here. I can already set up this Erica over here. And then I need to set up Plumeria somewhere over here. So turn one, test this trap. I can do that with Regan by either going after this. If it isn't, then I'll just move Regan over here. If it is, then I can I dance her. Do not know. And then still break this and move over here because I'll still have Kanto. And Erica can move you. over here. I still have to turn set up over turn here? two. All right, that one was the important one for me. Yes. All right, Erica, I need so to see fun. if she can kill them. Cancel me. Yeah, she can kill. Even without the buffs, I think she can get this kill. My orders? You need to set up. You I guess I could set you up right here. I didn't go turn one after you though. Leave it to me. Apparently I can go turn one after him. I can set up on turn one, but I can go on turn one after him. Consider it done. Because that will put me I'll be able to back up over here and then use Altina to reposition With her out. Certainty. So let's first check. Yes. So yeah, I'm gonna go after him on turn one. No reason really to Wait till turn two. My strength is my conviction. Close your eyes. Consider it done. All right. So this actually offers me yes. a new path. So I know this is the real one, but yeah. I can move right in here and go one, two, three and kill. So that's fine. Not really a problem there. All I have to do is make sure that Celica, I mean, uh, Lysidia cannot reach uh, to attack, which means don't have anyone where Zeros is, basically. This is a plus one Zeros. Plus one Lysitia. One Duma. And two Ophelia. As for Ophelia, we can easily take we can easily clear this area, I guess. That's not a problem then. Let me aid you. Alright. So take out Zeros. Need it be, I do Leave have uh, I won't Erica to help over here. Looks like it's my turn. Over here? Alright, so we take out Celica. We'll see if her miracle works on her face. Because I'm not actually sure. Yeah. yeah, her miracle also works on her face. And then we just move right here. You have my trust. My orders. Take out Ophelia. <laughs> Why not? Consider it done. <laughs> Keep 
Keep your eyes on me. All right. That takes care of that. So all that is left is Doma, which I didn't see if he had boots. I'm pretty sure he didn't. No, he does not have boots. Yeah. So he can't really get out of there. But we certainly can. So fun. Counsel me. With utter certainty. You have my trust. Yes. Oh, I'll do it. Counsel me. Canto. Yes. And canto. All right, and that is pretty much it. Leave it to me. Erica easily takes a Duma. Huh. All right, we were able to play her face it. Yeah, we s think it was a smart idea to go after Dimitri on turn one. Alright, that sets us up for tomorrow. Day six. Day six. Yes. Um we'll start with a battle. Uh, just in case something happens. Um I think we have like three ladders, so we do have to be careful. Settings, settings, settings. He's gonna be a pain though. I mean, he has a lot of defense. He'll hit with like 50 plus defense. I don't have that much defense. So it's not gonna be that easy. Uh, we'll stop you from, I don't know, getting down somehow. We want Niffle over here, but how do I get Niffle there? Not really a way for me to get Niffle there. And still... Well, I don't need far save on turn 1, I guess. Because the only one that could reach... I mean, the only one is Alphonse and he can really reach. So... We'll take advantage of not needing it on turn 1. The main reason I want to go this way is and not this way is because I got to get rid of uh, Dimitri as fast as possible. I don't think he can do 56 damage to me in one hit. And that's basically it. If he can do 50 if he cannot do 56 damage to me, he's not able to one shot me. Mira move. Mira just moves one spot though. If um mostly because she won't be able to dance so I'm gonna assume that she doesn't go any further than that. You have my trust. Doesn't do 57 damage but it gets pretty stupidly close. Yeah, of course. This is one of the problems I knew I was gonna have. As you say, explain. I really can. It is decided. So we know how much damage he did, and that's not fun, especially because Rhea is in near save, which I knew it was gonna happen. I wasn't looking forward to it, but With utter certainty. it was something that was going to happen. I love you. 
Over here? Explain. Alright, so she will have more HP next turn. Consider it done. This is not my Miravillis, so... Yeah. My trust. Let's find happiness with utter certainty. Orders, please. Lady Niffle. Yes. That was another. Extremely close. God is guide me. All right, that takes care of that. I won't lose. Sixty one, twenty eight. You have my trust. Hmm. How much damage could Alpina do? I mean, she's gonna hit me with her special, so... Explain. Alright. How do I deal with Nemesis this turn? I also gotta watch out for this, the witch is about to go off. He does have the damage reduction. He doesn't hit as hard as Dimitri because, of, and he doesn't have an auto double. So the problem is he still be staying near Rhea. Four sixty-eight, nine. I mean, thirty-three. That's a lot of damage. So you have my trust. I'll protect you. Yeah. How many merges on this rare? Plus three. Fjorm can take her, I just don't have Fjorm available at the moment. Alright, at least we have Ether ready. Alright, let's see how much damage she does. I think we can finish her off with Regan. I won't wait. Yeah. That's 19 damage. Yes. And she'll have 19 HP. Consider it done. No way to heal. Turn four. It's starting to eat my turns though. Over here? Lady All right. Yeah. This does have panic mode, so... I would love to move you over here to heal, but... 
I guess I could, but it's definitely not recommended. This does 26 exactly. Alright, get rid of Nemesis, finally. I still have to get the Aether on Duma's side, which I don't like. Should be like 18 damage. 26 damage. Alright, this is turn 5 or 6. I hope it's 5 because I need somehow to be able to reach that other ether. Alright, turn 5. It is decided. As you say. Yes. Yes? Over here? Um... Lady Niffle. One, two, three. Yes? He has to move here. With utter certainty. Which means I can do something like this to get careful, careful. I'll protect you. Break this. All right, I think I can do it on one turn. The wolves don't really matter much to Fjorn. Yes. All right, we got this. Get the ether. As you say. Let's find happiness. Get this. Consider it done. Over here? Get this. Orders, please. And bye bye Duma. First for me. Even though he healed not enough. Uh, yeah, that Dimitri hit way harder than expected. Alright, um, 140, we recovered 70, so that's two 100 matches puts us... That's 210. So I gotta do a 100 match right now. Otherwise, I'll end up doing like three matches tomorrow. Yeah, because if I do one right now, 100, I'll gain 20, I'll have 60. 60 and 70 is 130. 100 and I get 20 is 50. So yeah, I got to do another match. Uh, four, we got four ladders. I guess I could also get it with uh, Regan. Sempion is you, so you're not gonna get dance anytime soon. Weaponless, I saw someone without weapon. Okay, Pion is weaponless. That's whatever. That means she doesn't get to kill herself. It's not a bad thing. Yeah. 
not seen anything weird at the moment. Remember there being something about like if you're stepping a range of something that's supposed to be able to attack you, even if you're technically outside of their range, they can still hit you. Alright, we'll move you here, that way Regan can reposition you over here and you can go to this spot. As for Fjorm. We can reposition here and take this spot. All right, here we go. Get Ike in there and get you out of there. Here comes Edelgar. I won't back down. Hey! Here I go. You can't stop me. I guess yeah, getting quad is not fun. Somehow I completely forgot about uh what's her face? Bridal Katria. Emerges in this Edelgar. Fully plus 10. Over here? We can still kill her. here he still kills because of the brave effect and that's literally it as always Katria teams is just turn out to be the most annoying teams there is The only reason I'm doing this is because um, For what's it called it uh, she doesn't have a weapon so I know that <laughs> even if I go all the way I'm not gonna lose well she's I'm not they're not gonna kill themselves because weaponless I would have taken it one unit loss but three units loss is basically like almost 120 points almost 200 points so Yeah, plus 10 Fallen Edelgar, and I think she was getting debuffed because of her unity being active. Alright, let's see if we can do this again. Alright, so I can stop Larry Shell's flash. I actually, I already know that this is possible thanks to this. Uh, but how do I get anywhere with this? These two spots are bad. 
I guess this spot right here is safe. The spot where Shida is actually on. Another one where the uh, throne is. So I could put one unit here, one unit here. That's two spaces. 41 speed. Okay, I do outspeed uh, Lysithia. So break this and you come down. One, one, two, three. You don't reach all the way down here. No weird rallies other than Mospel, which is fine because um, he doesn't have damage reduction and he's a cab. And he's gonna go over here to rally uh, Lilina. All right, um, break, move up, dance, you go here. I will go. We break this just because we know nothing can actually reach all the way where Elamin is. Break and go down. And yep, we'll see what happens. You still have Vantage because you don't have Hardy Bearing. And we stop your flash, so... We actually do get hurt by Mira. Unfortunately, that uh, what do you call it? Effect thing cannot think guard guard effect made it so I could not pick up any things, words, remember hard um that i could not pick up any charges all right let's see there's still a problem because now dagger can reach all right so first we kill mospel We just need to be outside of Dagger's range, which Dagger's range is one the gravity trap, one next to the gravity trap movement. So she can move one space, two spaces, and shoot right here. Uh, we can take one hit, but we'll vantage the first hit because we just attacked, but I don't think we one shot her, so that is a no. No hardy bearing on you, so. You're pretty much dead. Dagger, dagger. Can dagger kill Altina? I don't think so. I'm gonna say no. Alright, so you move here to bait out Lysitia, which I'm still in the range of Lysitia right now. Like this spot right here is still Lysitia in the range of Lysitia. And we don't want that. Over here? So. Mm, yes. Move Fiom right here. Yeah. Move you right here dance you 
Just so I can move you out of the way. I won't lose. With and I think that's the safest spot for you. I can't really move you here because again, Lysitia, one, two, three, hit. And she'll get her brave effect and kill me, so. We'll just have to trust Altina. Yeah, no problem here. By these twin blades. And Bantish Lysitia. Which leaves us with where does... Alright. Not bad because we can still... Do this. And get that ether next turn. From the looks of it, she is chasing after Plumeria. Which is fine for us. Not a big deal. We'll put you right here. That way I can force you to go left or right. And either side I can block with Fjorn. Alright. Ether. So long, Seros. All right, there we go. We're able to take it. I'm so glad I got Sheeta. It is ridiculous how much uh, these cab lines just fall apart uh, in front of her. All right, there we go. So. A 150 for tomorrow day seven the final day and we're just gonna jump into the battle we do have a little bit of time but i am waiting on someone that's coming over so we just need ascend the fjorm to be the one that tanks over here we do want to at the very least block off one of the asuras like this we need you to be here all right so it will be like this break this I won't lose. go here to go over here go here All right, we'll see what happens. Dance. Rally, rally. You really can move. There he goes, and finally. All right, we took care of Chrome. Erica, no gale force. Wings, wings, wings of mercy, wings of mercy. There is wings of mercy on this too. Yeah. Right now, nobody is actually being baited. So we can bait Azura. We can have Azura attack since nobody is technically in yes. any kind of range. With rallies and no repositions other than yours. One, two, three. Reposition someone from here. One, two, three. I'll right, you. so we are safe right there. Speak. Azura should come. Or not, I guess. That couldn't happen. I'll comply. All right, take out Erica. Ah! 
Do we bait both of you? You have to attack this time. You don't have a rally target. I see no one can rally you and you go and dance him. You have a chance of going after Altina. We don't want that. Here, I guess I could swap and then repo you out. Gear Force. I don't have no follow-up, so oh, I'll do it. I guess it's best not to play it. Your orders. All right, Azura is gone. Dance, can you reach? You did not reach. Thank God. You have my trust. Why not? Yeah, that wouldn't Over be a here? good one. Yes. I can't really kill you. Yes? Guess with Fiorm I can kill you. Hit hit dance. I'll comply. Take you out. That still leaves me Seiros as a problem. Because she can double on player face. I will go. I won't lose. 32 damage. I'll protect you. So Fionn should be able to take you out after that. I don't think you get ether out of it. Four. No, you might actually get ether, and that might actually just be what you need to survive. Over here. All right, let's see. He'll he'll get panic regardless. Alright, I can finish you off. Close your eyes. Your orders. Yeah. I'll protect you. Still need to see how I'm gonna deal with Sarah so she doesn't kill somebody. And that's somebody I mean Altina. Counting on you, Dimitri. Don't die. Nah, he's dead. Because she's gonna dance. Alright, I'm gonna take this one loss. But I do need to get the ether done. Consider it done. Lady Niffle. How do I get the ether while keeping Mira? Over here? Yeah. Speak. Yes? Close your eyes. I won't lose. You right. have my trust. We can take one hit and because we have um 
our twin blades active. Goddess guide me. I mean, even without it, we would have gotten the kill regardless, but. Alright, I'll take that. It's 20 points. It might be the difference between making it or not, but I really just don't have the time to not take this. Should be at 394 points? 386, 386. Seven fourteen. I score 203, so yeah. It's enough to get me to tier 38, not tier 39, but I think tier 39 was out of the out of the run from the get-go. All right, Bride of Fjorm, regular Fjorm. I don't need far save. I would if I was taking on Byleth, but I'm purposely not in by left range. Alright, so you go and break this. You go and reposition her. So she goes here so she can move to this spot right here. The only thing is if Seros lives, she'll get danced, which is absolutely fine. Trying to see if there's a way I can get Fjorm ready. I guess I can far save if I wanted to. Because I can go in and reposition her. And just stay right there. Sixty-five. That does affect everybody. This is the only thread that I'm worried about, Bylef. That's it. Let's find happiness. Over here. All right. Do I want a far save or not? Forty-two, sixty-two. That's twenty damage. Sixty-one, forty-five. Uh, plus 5 is 66, uh, so 16 damage. Yes, Lady Niffle. I guess, yeah, we should far save just in case. Yes. Just in case. My trust. Oh, that Azura is the same unit. I was like, no same unit. All right, so Cyrus is gone. And Chrome is gone. And we shut down Mira again. This time Azura is not the same unit. As you say. I guess yeah, we can just finish it right here. Orders, please. Lighter, of ice. I think yeah. We don't need the ether because this is the final fight. Only I'll only be able to collect 10 points anyway. Careful, careful. No dancing. And you'll get far save. I won't lose. Yeah. With yeah. I guess that's it. Over here? It is decided.
There goes Byleth, which is like the only real threat, but not so much against the Sendefjorn. Corrin, which is Corrin is starting to look like she needs a refine. Mostly because uh, she's just getting taken out way too easily nowadays. And guard effects really destroyed her. And because not having no uh, no C disrupt means healers or sweep effects can really hurt her. Are you ready? And we don't fully heal, but oh yeah, we did fully heal. I don't know. We did not fully heal. Alright, that's it. That one wasn't very bad. It's basically just tank and that's it. We didn't need the ether, but yeah, at 38, 9.15, it would have only been 20 points, so it would have been 9.35. So not enough to get me those points. So yeah, obviously not tier 39, so we didn't do as good this week, mostly because we just missed a full day, which is basically wouldn't have been any more matches, but it would have been... 200 extra points. Puts us a night place with Matt at number one with this very, very nice pilot. Promise, Neo Sourceman, Dark Cluster, Diego, CMA, Michael, Bray Blitz, Dux, Yakiomi, Oron, Kako. Bean, and everybody else. Ah, of course. Uh, chaos season next week So it should be fun. We'll see what we come up with um, What team is it set up right now for chaos season? Number 12 which is team 12 uh, Okay, so this is the team that's currently set up. Um, we'll work on it uh, We'll see what we use As for summoning, we still have till tomorrow, so uh, for right now we'll redeem on this, colorless, obviously, I mean Idun is pretty good and I don't have her, but Idun, Fallen, Edelgard, we've seen Fallen Edelgard just bodied us this week, so. But, we only get a Lena. Uh, legendary banner trailer should be tonight. Yeah, we didn't get it last night. Nah, let's I miss it for some reason, but no. Uh, so, legendary trailer tonight. Um, should also be getting information on the refines for next month if see if um, it is brave heroes or not but yeah with all that being said thank you all for watching i'll see you next time bye